guys Andrew here welcome back to Drew tutorial and if you're seeing the channel for the first time special welcome to you and in this video I'm gonna show you how to install Google Drive on your Windows or Mac computer right so in order to do that guys you want to open up your Google Chrome and I'm at google.com right now there's two ways how to go about install this if you open up your browser and head into your Google Drive, let me show you in another window, you might see on the lower left hand side that once you're inside Drive, it will give you this option to say get Drive for desktop, right? And you can simply hit the download here. If you're not seeing this inside your Google Drive, let me open up another window. Let's say you go to the Google Drive and I'm going to open up Google Drive here. You might realize that you don't see the pop up, right? But in order to download it and install Google Drive on your computer, there are two ways to go about doing that. A previous way that I've showed in the past is basically you want to click on that and then you can go down to cast save and share and then you will be able to have the install option right here currently mine is saying open in google drive but that's going to open it into a window right and this is how i have it when you will install it it'll be opening up in a window just like this but you can install the app directly to your computer so how do you do that you want to look on the left hand side once you're inside google drive you will see the option that says computers you want to click on that and here it will basically tell you if you have any folders or files sync currently you see that there is none but you want to click on learn more and here you will see the option install and set up drive for desktop you have two options you have the mac and you have the windows you can click the drop down to see the options and the download button and you can download it here now i'm on a windows so i'm gonna do it for windows but you can see the mac is pretty straightforward so click the drop down click download for windows and you will see it start to download directly now once this is downloaded you can easily go ahead and install that so as you can see in a moment mine will be finished downloading and i can just simple click on that exe file right and it's going to give me a pop-up i click on yes then you can see it says if you want to add shortcut to your desktop and so forth and so forth right you can also add an application shortcut to your desktop I'm going to add application shortcut to my desktop as well then just simply click and install and it's going to install this application directly to my computer and this is very handy if you're using google drive pretty often you can easily go ahead and have this application on your computer so once it is done it says google drive successfully installed just simply click and launch and here you can see that it is there so here you have the welcome you can get started here guys then you'll need to sign into your account i'm going to sign into my account and here it says successful so i can just simply go back to the application or the application will restart by itself and as you can see it is there so here it is showing me like the folders that i can choose to sync and so forth and so forth or you can add a folder right you can always go ahead and skip this but this is just a welcome so i can skip that for now right click and got it skip for now from here just go ahead and click on next and from here you can just simply go ahead and open drive so once it is done dear guys let me go ahead and minimize everything you will see that i have it on my desktop i even have the option to open google docs google sheet and even google slides so i'm going to simply go ahead and open up the google drive and you will see it loads up on the other side of my screen so it opens up like this so here you will have it on the computer you have it under this pc as a google drive so if you go to this pc you will see now that you have the drive directly under your google drive how cool is that so you have it as a g drive on your computer and you can easily go ahead and copy files over to it so for myself when i record videos and so forth i can simply open up the drive and open up my drive and you can see all of those folders and things that i have on my drive and i can always go ahead and you know copy files there remove files and so forth but that's it guys that's how you go ahead and install google drive on your windows pc or your mac it is very cool and no longer you have to install this through the browser but you can just easily have it on your computer as a G drive. Very cool, right? 